a former Division I receiver at the University of Dakota, I grew up idolizing Chad Ochocinco. The way he worked out, the way he trained, his footwork, the way that he got away from def defenders running routes. I loved watching him play. And of all the places in the world, who would have thought that it would be in Mexico City that I would get to meet one of my childhood idols, Chad Ochocinco? Well, guess what? It happened a couple of weeks ago here in Mexico at Heat MX, a massive fitness festival. And I want to show you guys my experience and Podium's experience hanging out with Chad Ochocinco for the day in Mexico. Let's get into it. First off, I can't help but laugh, but to think about that, I met Chad Ochocinco, the man who previously is known as Chad Johnson, who changed his name to Chad Ochocinco several years ago when he was in the league, that I meet him here in Mexico. He changes his name to Spanish, and I meet him in Mexico. I love it. Well, come to find out, he loves Mexico. And the reason I got to meet Chad was because Podium, my company, the leading media and recruitment agency for American football outside of the United States, was managing the American football section and performance area at, at a festival called Heat MX, a massive fitness festival with all of the top fitness industry people in attendance. We're talking 20,000 plus people coming to learn every single type of sport, every type of training, um, how to work out, how to do certain lifts. It, it's an absolutely incredible event. And so in the American football section, Podium, we were testing athletes on how to, how to do ladder drills, how to run 40s, how to uh, properly train for American football, how to throw the football, how to catch. Um, we were timing people just as if it was similar to a real NFL combine in the United States, which was absolutely awesome because people here in Mexico especially don't really understand how difficult some of those testing measurements are to get to the NFL. And Chad Ochocinco was the headliner of the event. So between Chad and Podium, we teamed up and we managed the American football area and we put on a show for several hundred people on the Saturday of the Heat MX Festival. It was super cool. Uh, Chad and I were showing people how to run routes, how to catch the ball, how to do ladder drills. Um, I mean, this is coming from the legend. Chad Johnson is the legend for ladder drills, for work, workout, for cutting and stopping and getting in and out of cuts in a, in a route. I, as I mentioned earlier, this guy is an absolute idol for me in the football world. And having the opportunity to coach and work with him and, and show young kids and athletes how to, how to do what he once did and what I once did, it was absolutely an incredible experience. Now you can go back into my videos and see that I actually have a receiver footwork video that's almost up to 40,000 views now. And most of the stuff that I learned in there, I learned from watching Chad Ochocinco work out 10 plus years ago. I mean, this guy knows everything. He was the epitome for how to run proper routes, how to, um, how to get away from defenders, how to make defenders think you're going one way and turn the other way. And so I used to train and watch and literally study the way that he played and that made me a much better receiver on the field. I'm a former Division I athlete at the University of South Dakota. I have all of the receiving records at the University of South Dakota, receiving touchdowns, receiving yards. Um, I thought I had an incredible opportunity to go to the NFL, but seven knee, knee surgeries later, the NFL didn't want damaged goods, so I took my talents overseas where I played in Europe for three years, and that is where Podium actually began. Just to give you guys the full atmosphere of, of my life and my career and how this thing comes full circle to Podium and why I am here in Mexico. Now, Chad is super cool. If you watched him on TV when he was playing, super loud, super energetic, in your face. Um, the type of guy that you want to be around, especially as an athlete. Now he's a little bit more reserved. Uh, obviously, he had hundreds of people trying to run up and talk to him. So, you know, that can obviously be overwhelming, especially in a foreign country. But super cool, super nice, really kind dude, down to earth, um, was really easy to work with. And um, 
Yeah, it was just an absolute pleasure having him on our side when we were putting on this American football exhibit at Heat MX. I mean, I just couldn't think of a better person to represent American football in the United States and help bring a positive image of American football to Mexico. And he did an absolutely incredible job of that. Now, again, if you watched him play previously, you see him swearing, you saw him talking trash on the field. And so some people would be like, well, he wouldn't be a good person to represent American football outside the United States. But I can assure you that he was super chill, um, really knowledgeable of the game, and was helping out young athletes understand the game better, which was cool to see. Um, the guy was really humble and really willing to share his knowledge. And so, Again, incredible experience for us at Podium to be able to work with him. Incredible experience for all the fans that got to see him and come to Heat MX. And what an opportunity for these fans to be able to come to the festival, pay 25 bucks for a couple days, and come and work out with Chad Ochocinco. I mean, props to the guys at Heat MX for putting that together. Shout out my homie Ricardo, who's managing that thing. He's killing it. Uh, but yes, incredible, incred incredible event at Heat MX. <laughs> At Podium, we've worked with a ton of NFL players at camps and events outside of the United States, but Chad Ochocinco is by far the biggest name that we've worked with so far, and as I said, as a former receiver, there's no one else that I would rather work with because I idolized him as a kid growing up. And so, what a day at Heat MX. I can't wait for next year's event and really all the rest of the events that we have in Mexico and in Europe in 2020 because we're bringing NFL outside the US. That's what we do here at Podium. So that is a wrap for this episode. Yo soy Will. Nos vemos pronto, amigos. Peace.